Well, listen, my mom and dad are probably going to watch this, so it better be good. Police have arrested and charged 38-year-old Tuong Phuc Huynh of Calgary with second-degree murder. A motive for the crime has not yet been released. Take our first break on the Channel 3 News at 5. Coming up next, part two of our special Life Watch look at the cochlear implant. We'll show you how it changed this teen's life. And still to come, an interview with Hollywood's $20 million man, Jim Carrey. The suspect fired several shots from his vehicle and then got out of his car and fired some more. Investigators say they believe the gunman is a former boyfriend of the teenage girl who lives at the house. Russian President Boris Yeltsin is struggling with another health problem. Yeltsin is in hospital in Moscow. A spokesman for Yeltsin says the president has a cold. But he says it was brought on by a respiratory virus infection and doctors were concerned it might turn into something worse. Well, it was kind of surreal, wasn't it? Ian? Well, I don't know if it was surreal, but it looked <laughs> nice. Thanks very much, Dave. Gretien said today that national unity will result in new jobs in Montreal. The problem is the investors are very nervous. They're very nervous. At this moment. And uh, the market for housing has dropped fantastically. We're back with more news right after we take this final break.